Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Union General Marcellus Monroe Crocker died on this day, August 26, 1865, at the age of 35. A brigadier general with the 4th Division of the 17th Army Corps, Crocker had attended the United States Military Academy at West Point, but left at the end of his second year to study and practice law in Iowa. With the outbreak of the Civil War, he entered the Army as captain with the 2nd Iowa Infantry, quickly rising to the rank of colonel and serving with distinctions at the Battle of Shiloh. In 1863, he participated in the Vicksburg Campaign, conducting raids in Mississippi with a brigade known as Crocker's Greyhounds for their swift marching ability. After the Union's occupation of Natchez in July 1863, Crocker served as commander of the Natchez District, which encompassed the city of Natchez as well as territory in Louisiana and Mississippi along the banks of the river. Crocker was popular among the wealthy planters of Natchez primarily because he allowed them to sell their cotton on the open market once they had taken the oath of allegiance to the United States government. Later, Crocker would lead a division at the Battle of Jackson, and he was praised for his actions at the Battle of Champion Hill. Hey, I'm Grace Sam White, a junior at Cathedral, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.